In the deepest Amazon, there is a place so special, UNESCO has declared it a World Heritage Site. It's the largest protected tropical rainforest on the planet. But a changing climate now threatens to destroy it forever. In the heart of the protected zone, a team of eco-warriors gives 360-degree access. They're in a struggle to save one of planet Earth's last Edens. The Amazon. Rivers over 50 kilometers wide, flowing through a green carpet 20 stories high. Over an area two-thirds the size of the continental U.S. Working silently and invisibly, it's helping to prevent a global warming catastrophe. Alessandro Araujo comes here to study how the Amazon keeps the Earth cool. This is Alessandro's commute to work. He hikes deep into the jungle and climbs a 52-meter tower to measure the gases in the Amazon air. This project is to raise the awareness of how important Amazonian rainforest is not only for locals, Amazonians, but for Earth in itself. Okay, pode mandar. Tá indo, Alessandro? A healthy Amazon is the planet's cooling mechanism, absorbing CO2, the greenhouse gas that is helping to warm the atmosphere. But lately, the cooling mechanism has been breaking down. The Amazon is drying up. A 2005 drought was the worst in living memory. An area bigger than 400,000 football fields burnt to the ground. Five years later, it happened again. Dead trees can't absorb CO2. And when they rot or burn, they actually release the gas. Droughts could occur more frequently, creating a devastating feedback loop. Parts of the Amazon could dry up into grasslands. The implications for the entire planet are enormous. Because of the Amazon's vital role for our planet, UNESCO has stepped in to protect a huge zone called the Central Amazon Conservation Complex. It covers an area bigger than Switzerland and is the largest protected stretch of tropical rainforest on Earth. This vast jungle is flooded half the year. Its floor sunk beneath 12 meters of water creating a unique ecosystem within the Amazon jungle. With few humans, virtually no roads, and enormous biological diversity. Among the unique inhabitants is the strange and elusive Amazonian manatee. A creature that needs the area's floods to survive. Veterinarian Carolina Jolivera is helping to save the manatee. At this floating base in one of the conservation area's vast lakes. Bom dia, pessoal. Bom dia. Tudo bem? E aí, como é que tá o trabalho? Já tá? Here, Carolina rehabilitates manatees found injured or orphaned. Today, Carolina gives them all a checkup. She'll weigh and measure all seven to see if they're healthy enough to go back to the wild. When they go free, it will be a first for Carolina. She has yet to release a rehabilitated manatee. The manatee is a pretty unique creature. There's nothing you can compare it to. 
No one is sure how many freshwater manatees are left, and they are only found in the Amazon.